Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. So, hello everyone. We're going to talk about what just happened a couple minutes ago on Phil's live stream. Actually, I think I still have to stream it where it brings up my PC. Yeah, I do. <coughs> Wait, let's see. Yep, 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 yeah, everything's good. Okay. All right, CJ. Let's let's talk about what just happened. Well, what happened was while Phil was playing Minecraft, <clears throat> yeah, while Phil was playing Minecraft, a mod of his, known as the Chancellor. Well, his name on here is gonna be. Uh, what is his name again? Uh, right now, right now. Let's see. What was his name? It was a Lionels or something like that. Wasn't it? I can't remember. The Lionels. It's not like that. That's what the thing is? I can't remember. Well, he always changed his name, dude. Yeah, I know his name is the Chancellor, but hold on. Let it me used go. to be it used to be like the Bottom the, line is. The bottom line is. That's his name. Bottom right. line is. But yeah. yeah. He yeah. is now banned from the chat. But there's a reason for that. He decided to go behind DSP's back. And unban a guy who's supposed to be permanently banned from the like from the stream chat. And if you don't know who I am, I am one of his mods as well. He is gay. The best mod he has. <laughs> but um, yeah. I was watching the stream. I was watching the stream. Usually I don't go in there from time to time, but I was watching the stream for the for a little bit, and I happened to see the chancellor or the line or bottom line is unban Liquid Hindu. And I was telling Mark Claire here, I was like, oh my god, Mark Claire, he just, he just fucking unbanned with it, Hindu. And I didn't think Phil saw it. I'm thinking maybe, maybe Phil told him he could be unbanned, but no, Phil immediately saw it too, because there's a 20 second delay on the stream. He saw it as well. The Chancellor apparently tried to sneak it, because, Mark Claire, you can tell this one. Okay. So, yeah, he tried to sneak on Van Liquid Hindo, right? And, uh, what had happened was, he, he unbanned him, and Phil was like, oh, um, why'd you unban him? So then Liquid Hindo was like, wait, not the Chancellor. Dude was like, oh, I thought if mods were okay with it, he can be unbanned. And Phil was like, oh, that's never been the case. Oh, then he tried to ban him back. He's like, that's not how it works. He's like, why'd you unban him, you know? So then he's like, he just starts lying. He's like, oh, Dream Yusuke told me to unban him. And then Yusuke was like, no, I didn't. I didn't tell him that. So Phil's like, uh, Yusuke says he didn't tell you to unban him, so why did you unban him? So then your boy, the Chancellor, he got that hard unmod hard. Like Phil, you know, the usual ego tripping, power tripping maniac, sociopath, like he is. So afterwards. Um, it was lit. Like, the chat was lit. Everyone was like, oh my god. Because, like, Phil literally stopped this whole chill, fake chill stream. Because, um, over, over one person being a man that he deemed not worthy of being a man. But, anywho. So, out of nowhere, right? Out of nowhere. The Chancellor just tell him the straight up truth. He's like, the reason why I unbanned Liquid Hingdo is because... You, you and this fucking cat scare. He's like, after that, I just can't, I just can't be a mod anymore. I, I, I don't, I don't want nothing to do with you anymore. After this whole cat scare, he's like, I can't take it. And this is one of his long time mods. This dude even went, this dude even went and did like, gay ops. He went in a detractor chat and just sat there, and waited for evidence of people who said something and referenced, cross reference names and ban people who were in the detractor chats or whatever. Like this dude was a long time like drone and fell so for even one of his long time mods to wake up out of the pygnosis and realize that this dude is nothing but a fucking scammer that that says a lot <clears throat> anything you want to add on CJ? well apparently uh, the chancellor or the, the bottom line is um, he was a he was a mod for a good while like I said uh, he was a year one year one year subscriber to film and he 
Yeah, he did everything for Phil, but like I guess with this cat thing, that uh, Phil like, said, Phil <laughs> says that it, the, the whole thing about the cat was uh, he wanted to do a charity live stream, but he said if they, if, if it does make a requirement, if y'all hit the thousand dollar goal, that he's gonna reveal a secret. Now, I don't like Phil, but that still seems like he, there was a scam. That's still, still you're paying. Still. You're paying. You put. You put information behind a paywall. That that scam. The cat is fucking DLC. I think that you're trying to do a charity live stream. It seemed like the charity when you said the charity live stream. It seemed like you were just saying I think, that. See, I think you, like, you meant fundraiser. Like we're, a fundraiser. fundraiser. Yeah, like you want to do this fundraiser, right? But it seemed like you only did that just to, like for like to cover yourself. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, because like, yeah, because like that was re- that was done playing. He's just supposed to play normally, just play uh, yeah. Super Mario sixty four. That was that was the arrangement. And all of a sudden, it, it changed to a marathon when that wasn't supposed to be the case. Yeah, and it, he said, uh, "Oh, I'm gonna uh, reveal something here." And it with the thousand dollar pay goal, you know, everybody thought it was gonna be like a really big secret. Now, honestly, I thought he was gonna tell everybody that he he his uh, wife is pregnant. Or he got a job or something, or he did this and uh, or something amazing, right? Or he's or, or here's one thing I I was expecting. Oh, I'm gonna get back into the fighting game community because he you know he was playing some fighting games there and there. Maybe he found his spark about fighting games and he wanted to you know go back to the fighting game community, you know. But obviously that wasn't the case. All of a sudden I, I get back to the stream when they I saw the the goal was hit. I come back to the stream and he's talking about a cat. Yeah, that like that's that's mundane basic information. Definitely not worth a thousand dollars. Definitely not worth two thousand dollars, which was the case. You got like twenty four hundred dollars for saying he had the cat. Like that's information. That's like so that's like basic information. Like when you're like, oh hey, what's up? Oh not much. Yeah, I got a cat. Oh cool. Yeah, it's like it's information in passing. It's nothing important. It's not a big reveal. It's not a life changing situation. It's it's like painting your your wall a different color, or you know, buying a new fucking outfit, buying a new headset for your your game console. It's nothing groundbreaking, nothing worth keeping a secret of, nothing yeah. worth paying two thousand dollars for. Honestly, if he would have just did like a two hundred dollar thing, and he was gonna reveal, I would have been a lot fucking a lot better. I would have felt a lot better about this if, if he wanted to reveal a cat two hundred dollar raise, you know. But no, he didn't do that. He made it to a thousand dollars and made it seem like, oh, you used to go and get this this special secret mine. A cat just you getting a cat is not really that much of a secret. Like, Come on. A cat that everyone already figured out and assumed that you had, that you lately lied and said you didn't, just like your marriage. Like, you lied about having the cat, and people called you out on it, and then you're like, oh, well, it's not a new cat. No one ever said it was a new cat. People just said you had a cat. But, you know, can't win. Is that pretty much everything, TJ? I think that sums up everything. But like I said before, I like him. I like Phil Stover. That, that, to me, kind of just blew my mind. I, it's I, just, I understand how the Tesla feels. Like, he's like, fuck it. I can't trust Bill anymore with I mean, this. this is why he lost a lot of months after that whole wedding scam. Yeah, like, what was it? Um, Lambo left. Uh, Lambo. I mean, Swag is that thing was banned before that. Yeah, he was banned over the whole Sekiro thing. But, yeah, the, uh, I think it was around that down, too, because I think the whole wedding thing kind of like the thing that said fuck it like everybody like we are I can ask you like where I just oh and Master Saru oh man I think Master Saru was trying to make it seem like I think he was trying to help Bill out in a way where people won't see how bad Bill is yeah, damage control. Uh, your boy yeah, you trying to damage control, control for him by making it seem like, yeah, Bill's change now all bad because you know there's a lot of people saying that, oh man, you can't for anything, Bill. 
and shit like that, right? And he, I guess Masasaru was trying to stop that type of talk so the detractors wouldn't be all over Bill. But, like, that ended up failing, and he's gone. And then, I, a long time, is the video still going? Yeah, yeah, still going. Oh. I mean, yeah, it's a little off topic, though. But, yeah, a long time, a long time, King of God or John something, John God something, I, I, he, can't, he went by a lot of names. The moment he stepped into the stream, I already knew that he was a detractor, even before he became mod. The way he was, it was like, you know how people are just way too friendly for no damn reason. Every time I would come to the chat, he will immediately say, yeah, hey, Yusuke, yeah, yeah, hey, Yusuke. And I'm like, what is up with this guy? Nobody is this happy. What the fuck is going on with this guy? And when he became mine, it's just like, oh man, shit, man, go down. But like I, 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 I called it, I told Mark Claire that I think King of all that fucking detractor. I, I, I think he is, but he's, he, he's just too happy with it. The shit, man. And random people kept getting unbanned that was banned. So, all we found out who it was, it was fucking King of Golf. So he's, he's losing a lot of mods. Hopefully, I can stay a mod, even though I kind of, you know, I'm, I, I kind of just hope that this whole thing is just a big misunderstanding for Phil. I'm hoping it is, but chances are it's probably not. That's all I got to say. Alrighty, but yeah, Chancellor, long time to, long time to drone a Phil. Long time, do we? Like I said, do we even went and did black gay ops, sitting in the detractor channels, banning people who with corresponding names and whatnot. And this dude was just all it feels ass. And even he, even he woke up out of the pignosis and he got tired of it. So there you have it. Thanks for watching.